Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Good evening everyone. I'm Rahaf Wali from Kung Saud bin Abdul Aziz University, Jeddah. Firstly, I would like to thank Respiratory Care Committee Supervisors for hosting me on Snapchat as a part of the team. Today, inshallah, I will try to summarize the basics of ACG that may benefit you in the future. Okay. ACG or electrocardiogram. It just visualizing the electricity that flows through the heart, so there is no risk of shock, since this procedure only monitors the electrical impulses and does not emit electricity. So, ACG is helpful in determining if the person's heart is beating normally, besides either a person has heart disease, chest pain, or palpitations. Okay, uh, let's talk about the electrophysiology of the heart, starting with the SA node. SA node, it's also called the pacemaker of the heart due to generation of the electrical impulses. So it's like a battery of the heart. Uh, the second thing is BR interval. Uh, BR interval is just a short delay when the impulse received by the AV node. Uh, the third thing is uh, QRS uh, complex. QRS complex is just a ventricle depolarization and contraction because of the stimulus uh, of uh, a stimulus through the bundle of his uh, uh, right and left uh, bundle branches and uh, Burkundi fibers. Okay, when we have a problem in the B wave, we can use it in the atria. Uh, بس لما لما يكون عندي المشكلة في ال QRS complex uh, راح على طول نربطها إنه على طول نربطها إنه يكون في مشكلة عندي في ال uh, ventricles of the heart. The last two things uh, are ST uh, ST uh, segment and T wave. Uh, ST segments are just a short delay after a ventricle contraction. But the T wave, it's a ventricle repolarization. Repolarization and add it to the top. Ventricle repolarization after uh, this uh, short delay. What about patient uh, positioning and preparation? The uh, patient uh, should be at supine position and it's important to shave uh, hair away from electrode placement site. Besides, we should drop an uh, electrode uh, placement site uh, briskly with alcohol bath, also rubbing a site with the uh, two by two gas. Finally, you may uh, place electrode and be sure that electrode has adequate gel and it's not dry. Okay, SEG uh, electrodes or LEDs, uh, there are 12 LEDs. Six limb lids and uh, six uh, chest lids. They are positioned at 12 different angles. So uh, this is like having 12 different cameras. So it's important to observe the heart electrical activity from more than one angles. If the electrodes are placed on arms and legs, they are called limb lids. Uh, but if on the chest, or exactly surrounding the heart, they are called pericardialids. pericardialids. As we say, uh, we have uh, six limb plates and six uh, chest lids. Starting with the limb plates, uh, there are we have three important limbs: our uh, right arm, left arm, and uh, left leg. Uh, and here is the first lid, second lid, and uh, third lid. The first split is the voltage between a right arm and the left arm. So from the negative uh, pole to the positive pole. Uh, the second uh, lit also from the negative pole to the positive pole. So from the right arm to the uh, left leg. The third lid also from the negative pole to the positive pole. So from the left uh, arm to the no, left leg. What about the three other limb plates? Uh, there are AVR, AVO, AVF. R from the right, left from the uh, AVO, L from the left, F from the foot, so uh, left leg. Uh, AVR, AVL, and AVF, they are unipolar because they use one limb electrode, that's a positive fall and take the average of the inputs from the other two as negative poles. 
يعني they are it's a right arm positive everything else negative they ill it's a left arm positive everything else uh, negative every if it's a le left leg neg uh, positive everything else negative okay uh, the six other uh, shistlets are v1 v2 v3 v4 v5 and uh, v6 uh, v1 and v2 uh, they are at uh, fourth intercostal uh, space but the v1 on the right side of the sternum and the v2 uh, is on the left side of the sternum uh, okay خلينا ناخذ الاعداد الزوجيه the uh, v4 and uh, v6 both of them are, both of them at uh, fifth intercostal space but the v4 uh هيكون at uh, left mid clavicle uh, uh, line while v6 هيكون uh, left uh, mid axillary line uh, v3 هيكون uh, between v2 and the uh, v4 uh, on the left side of the chest هيكون uh, while uh, v5 also between v4 and uh, v6 on the left side let's talk about an important thing is the ACG paper AC, ACG paper it consists of uh, large boxes uh, and small boxes inside them so let's take uh, one large box the horizontal part it indicates a time so one small box equals 0 0.04 second and one large box equals 0 0.20 second if there are five large boxes it will equal one second uh, okay, what about the ventricle part? The ventricle part, it indicates the electrical voltage. So, one large box equals 0.5 millivoltage. Okay, let's talk about, uh, let's talk about uh, rhythm analysis. Uh, there are five steps. We'll talk about them in details. Uh, starting with step number one, calculate the rate. Calculate the rate in two ways. In a large box, which is large boxes, or small box, which is small boxes. If it was in a large box, what we will do is we will mix them. 300 divided by number of large blocks between the RR waves. Uh, or 1500 divided by number of small blocks between RR waves. So let's uh, take a home message that normal heart rate in adult uh, is uh, from uh, 6 to uh, 100. Uh, less than 60, it's called bradycardia. More than 100, it's called tachycardia. Okay, step number two is determine regularity. If we went to determine regularity, we should look at the RR distances between the pulses. So look at the example here. The distances between the RR uh, waves are the same, so the interpretation is regular. Uh, the interpretation uh, may be uh, also occasionally regular, regularly regular. Irregularly irregular. We'll talk uh, more about them in the next slides. Okay, step number three is assess the B waves. I come through four important questions. Uh, first question: Are there P waves? Hal موجود في B wave? The second uh, one: Do the P waves all look alike? Hal كلها تشبه بعض? Uh, three: uh, Do the B waves occur at a regular rate? موجودة في كل pulse. Is there one B wave before each QRS complex? Here had the QRS complex. Hal موجود في one B wave before it. Uh, as the, the example here, the interpretation is normal B waves. It حقق الشروط. Step number four is determine the QRS duration. QRS duration it should be uh, from one to two, from one to three small boxes. So, 0 0.04 to 0 0.12 second. Uh, the example here, uh, the, uh, interpretation is uh, one box. The QRS duration is one box. So, uh, it equals uh, 0 0.04 second. It's a normal QRS duration. Okay, the last step is uh, 
determine the BR interval. BR interval. It should be from three to five small boxes. So zero point twelve to zero point twenty second. يعني QRS from one to three small boxes. BR interval from three to five small boxes. Um, the example here. Indicates that interpretation uh, is of three boxes, three boxes, three small boxes. So it's a QL 0.12 uh, second. Uh, it is a normal PR interval. Okay, I'll show you how to talk about today. Inshallah, today is some basic important examples. Uh, I'll talk in the beginning, starting with the sinus family. Sinus family uh, are normal sinus rhythm, sinus bradycardia, sinus tachycardia, sinus aristosystole. غالباً المشكلة مع sinus family تكون ال heart rate. إذا كان within a normal range, تكون normal. إذا كانت below 60, تكون sinus bradycardia. إذا كانت uh, more than uh, 100, تكون sinus tachycardia. ذهن uh, الexample. Uh, everything is normal, heart rate is normal, regularity is normal, B wave uh, normal, BR interval within a normal range, QRS complex also within a normal range. So the interpretation here is sin uh, normal sinus rhythm. Okay, this is a sinus predicardia. Uh, the space between the uh, RR is uh, very large and uh, As we said, uh, the problem here is uh, the heart rate. The heart rate is uh, less than a uh, normal range. Uh, in this example, uh, it is 35. So it's uh, very low. And uh, we can treat uh, this case by the underlying, uh, through the underlying cause. على حسب الكوز اللي سببت البريديكاردية حنعالجها. Okay, this is a sinus tachycardia. Uh, the space between the R are too small, so uh, the heart rate is more than a normal range. Uh, in this example, it is uh, 130. Uh, 130. Uh, the treatment uh, is oxygen. Okay, uh, the last uh, thing here. Or in this group is asystole or sinus arrest. Uh, as you see, there is no electrical activity, so no cardiac output and no pulse. So if you want to know the heart rate, the heart rate here is absent due to absence of ventricle activity. There is no ventricle activity. The treatment here is CBR with no defibrillation or shock. Okay, uh, and the second group is uh, atrial family. Al atrial family and the atrial tachycardia, atrial flutter, and atrial fibrillation. Uh, starting with atrial tachycardia. Bimen na tachycardia, ma natal heart rate uh, very high. Is here, ah, na gunna ida ka galiban al mushkila fil B waves. Zay hina. We cannot differentiate between the P waves and the T waves. So the P waves it's different from uh, the sinus P wave. Uh, so the kind of the B wave, I'll tell you, they're atrial, uh, atrial problems. So in this example, heart rate, uh, as we said, the heart rate uh, very high. The B waves differ from a sinus B wave, can be lost in T waves, and you cannot differentiate between them. Uh, BR interval may be difficult to measure. BR interval comes from here to here. May be difficult to measure because we cannot uh, define uh, what is the real B waves. Okay, the second uh, uh, example is atrial flutter. Atrial flutter, or also called the uh, saw tooth pattern, is the asnan al minshar. ال B waves شكلها flutter waves عشان كده سميناها flutter وشكل ال atrial uh, atrial waves شكلها زي ال زي أسنان المنشار so لما نيجي نشوف ال heart rate هنلاقي المشكلة في ال atrial ال atrial uh, heart rate very high 
حيكون from 250 to 350 uh, B waves uh, زي ما قلنا flutter waves and the BR uh, interval the last example in atrial group is uh, atrial fibrillation أو يسموه رجفان الأذيني آه برضو بما أن المشكلة أتري معناته عندي مشكلة فين في البي ويف البي ويف طبعا باين إنه إيش كان بي ميجرد آه so آه if the B wave cannot be measured the R interval also cannot be measured الهارت ريت آه البروبلم مع الأتري الأتري الهارت ريت الأتري الهارت ريت إيش unmeasurable لا يمكن قياسه اوكي آه حننتقل لـ third group اللي هو الـ ventricle group غالبا الـ ventricle مع إذا قلنا إحنا قلنا الـ ventricle معناته المشكلة مع الـ QRS complex آه so start with the ventricle tachycardia الـ ventricle tachycardia آه عشان نفرق بينها وبين الـ ventricle fibrillation اللي هو الرجفان البطيني شكلها هيكون زي أذان الأرنب لو تجوا تلاحظوا شكلها زي أذان الأرنب So the heart rate is unable to obtain. A regularity is unable to obtain. Also, P waves, mafi B waves, B R interval. In the B waves, none. Haki the B R interval ha kun none. La tujat lah zul Q R S complex is wide and wide and bizarre. So more than zero point twelve second. Not within a normal range. الventricular fibrillation اللي هو الرجفان البطيني زي ما تشوفوا هنا برضو ال problem is with the QRS complex so everything everything here is unable to obtain heart rate regularity B waves B R interval and QRS complex and this is the shape of the waveform اوكي اخر ثلاثة اشياء حتكلم عنها ان شاء الله اليوم اللي هو ال PAC ال BVC and ال PEA ال BVC اللي هو ال premature atrial contraction اللي هو انقباض الاذين قبل اوانه فزي المثال الموجود هنا ال heart rate normal ال regularly uh, echo general irregular ليش لانه ال pulse هنا ال pulse الموجود هنا is irregular بسبب ال prematurity ال B waves the wave of the premature will be different كلها normal ما عاد ال wave حاجة ال premature ال B wave هنا مختلفة ال B R interval normal QRS complex normal so المشكلة هنا بما انه برضو لاحظ انه المشكلة B wave so atria على طول نربطها انه ايش حتكون atrial problem الشكل في تغيير في شكل ال B wave عشان كده قلنا premature premature atrial contraction the second example is BVC اللي هو premature ventricle contraction بما انها مشكلة في الventricle معناته المشكلة في اللي هو ال QRS premature يعني قبل اوانه معناته انقباض البطيني قبل اوانه طبعا ال heart rate normal regularly occasionally irregular نفس اللي هو المثال اللي قبله بسبب هذا ال pulse abnormal pulse ال P wave كلها موجودة ما عادة في ال 7 QRS it's not existing BR interval normal and QRS complex هي normal ولكن wide and bizarre بتميز ال premature ventricle contraction انه ال QRS complex بتكون wide and bizarre The last thing I will talk about is PA, pulseless electrical activity. The definition is it's a clinical condition characterized by unresponsiveness and lack of palpable pulse in the presence of organized electrical activity. يعني حيكون في normal ACG, حيكون في organized electrical activity, ولكن when the provider make the assessment, he does not, he does not, or he will not find any palpable pulse. So the treatment here is doing CBR without shock or defibrillation. 
Okay, this is the end of my presentation. Inshallah, ma kunt awalt alaykum. Thank you so much for watching and listening my presentation, guys. I hope you a wonderful future, inshallah.